Welcome to the last part of Achille Marozzo's Dual Swords, Chapter 84. This contains some useful techniques and a way to return from play, which is very typical for the Bolognese style of sword fighting. We start with the right leg forward, right hand at our right side, left hand at our left side, and swords pointing towards the opponent. Strike a falso with your left, to whichever hand of your opponent seems more exposed to provoke a reaction. Parry whatever blow they throw at you with the hanging position of your right sword while stepping forward with your left foot and thrusting a punta ferma to their chest with your left sword. From there, retreat with your left foot and let your right sword turn in the manner of a tramazzone into a full downward blow to the head, which ends in Porta di Ferro Larga. Next up is our return from play. We begin with a half turn of both hands to our right. The text indicates our left hand falling from a stretta position into Cinghiare Porta di Ferro. So I guess it's Larga. From here we step back with our right and perform four strikes from our right, two falsi and two true edge strikes. Our left hand clears any thrusts towards our torso or head and our right protects us from any blows like in the last week's exercise. We end in a mirrored position on our left side with the left leg leading and just do the same thing once again, just from our left and stepping back with our left foot. This action is actually quite similar to Antonio Manciolino's lesson on dual swords. He just starts in Guardia di Testa with the upper sword and in a strata position with the lower one. To conclude, we draw our left foot close to our right, stretch both of our arms, right up high, left down and low, and that's it. Our journey is now at an end. But as the summer comes, we will hopefully be able to train and film partner exercises once again. I very much plan on recording all of these lessons as paired exercises. And additionally also record some sparring. If you don't want to miss it, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Also leave suggestions for future series in the comments. I have to be economic with my time, but I want to produce content that is interesting and helpful for you. Until next time, enjoy your training! <laughs>